I'm old, I'm blind, motherfucker. Shit. And we are live, people. Straight from the SFA. We have a huge audience behind us, as you can hear. Right. All this around. is based around just sarcastic assholeism. As the kids say, real talk. <laughs> <laughs> Could you just sit with a guitar instead of saying anything? Just bing. Everybody move in. Well, wait, which there, we're way? good. We're good. No, Dude, where's wait. the applause? Give the applause. <laughs> Fine oiled machine. Oh, well. Performance. I'm a performer. Aren't you supposed to be wearing your mask, Jim? Yeah. Sick boy? Yeah. I sponsor my own show. Dude, surfers can punt, so all that <laughs> swimming? Yeah. Had you already changed into your dress, or? Um, no, I wear my dress now all the okay. time. I'm just out. So Banana milkshake! What size is your chicken sandwich? Where does your mom live? This is great. <laughs> I'm ripping. <laughs> As they're funneling their way out the doors, I just kept screaming, babe, roof, nigga, and hitting them in their face with my truck. Oh, we got it. We got it. Nottis gave me this board. <laughs> I kind of want to throw all these boards into the bay and be like, there's my skateboard they're collection. Yeah. No one ever does this on a live talk show right here. This is, right? this is pioneering. And I go into the bathroom and you know those rails, you never know what they're for. <laughs> It's like, <laughs> what we do, we'd drive around and we'd see people and we'd say, you drop something, but then we'd yell tuna. It doesn't even look like the same species. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look how big his head is. That's insanity. We're 30 seconds into the first show and it's already fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> what a dick. 450 is way way too much for any beer. This is what I'm talking about. If I'm so, gonna drink crappy beer, I wanna pay crappy prices. <laughs> That's the point. Yeah. Like they wanna know the smallest detail. Like, hey, that one part in that one. <laughs> Intense city? Yeah. Did he really? You know, light his fart on fire or whatever, and you're like, he really did it. Oh, <laughs> man. Like a penguin, it's not me, just but a penguin it. just holds the thing over. Can we just do that? Thanks, Chili. All right, I, I can run with that, that's cool. Then you see Virch gating, you're just like, wow. And then you see like me florfing around in the, in the greasy parking lot on a curb. Don't ask me anyone on the team. Kyle Lepper, Kyle. <laughs> Justin. Uh, that's good. Nice I was throwing my board on Market Street, cursing at businessmen to get the fuck out of my way, just throwing it, fuck you, fuck everyone. The only two phones we need on here are mine and his. Actually mine, you don't need yours on. Okay. No one's gonna text you. That's really is that really cool. Your phone? Is that me? What the fuck? Oh, let's see. Oh, hold on a sec. Who is it? Let's see. It's Lance Mountain. We went to I school, was... high school together, McAteer. Yeah. Which was a frightening, frightening, frightening school. Although, <laughs> although they fucked you up a bunch of times. Oh, all the time. I mean, remember the photo on the wall? Oh yeah. Where you passed out like cigarettes. Oh yeah. In your right. nose. Yeah, that was my friends. Yeah. I would say it's not executed well. I don't Are know. You flattered? No, I don't know if she probably got it for me, but it's probably just more of the design. To this day, he does not believe a word I say. Like, the sky's blue. He's like, I gotta Google that. <laughs> Son of a bitch, I don't think so. How did you get on real skateboards? I think I like followed Jim and Tommy around San Francisco, like licking their balls or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! Yeah. Fuck off! That's a secret. That, that's a secret. I knew about that. Mick told me. You know that little green shit that everybody's been putting on everything? Do not fucking put cilantro on anything unless it says it on the menu. Okay, if you're in the van and you need to take a piss, do you say piss stop or you just grab a bottle? You know, if you're the only one, you grab a bottle, you know, 20 minutes later, somebody like, I got piss too. And then four people get out. But. Yeah. Here's the two times I've been mad at you. I watch your show and you're like, if someone's got to take a piss, you know, piss in a bottle. And I probably just had my second beer of my life. And, I, and you're, nice. you're like, pee in a bottle. So I'm back there for at least an hour and a half. Just like, Tommy, please pull the van over. <laughs> Are you cool now you squashed it? Yeah, I just, <laughs> squashed I just it. want to talk about that. Now let's start the show. All right. Yeah. Hello, Mickey Ray's. Oh, you know what? I just hung up on him. I peed in his ice tray at a party. The next morning, he called me and was like, I'm gonna fucking kill you. And I was like, what if I get somebody to beat me up at the house? T-Dog or not? Is he? <laughs> Come on, dude. <laughs> what a T-Dog. <laughs> He's an asshole. You know he cut my chin with a bottle once. What? Yeah, so I snatched him in like a half hour headlock. Wait, what? Dude, that's Coco, right? No, that's, that's Tommy! <laughs> oh, what? Oh! <laughs>
<laughs> here's here's what I do. Hey, you know what? I used to do the downward dog. I used to do the fucking this fucking thing. Lance, who are you skating with? Um, John Lucero was supposed to come. He did not again. <laughs> We're heading to the Casting Ponds, which is a spot in Golden Gate Park that we used to skate, I guess, about 30 years ago when they would drain it. And it's only a three to four day window that you have to skate this spot. I saw a posting on Instagram and, you know, I got all angry and old and like, get off my lawn, son of a, no one called me and said, don't they know, you know, I live five minutes from there. That was my natural instinct to just panic and wave my hand like, and I was like, could get through there. Parting of like yeah. the, the Red Sea of children. Thanks for that lady. I can't even imagine. Yeah. Pay attention. Yeah. So you, you worked at a skate shop for a year after you won the very first pro street contest. Yeah. How much did you win at that contest? 350 bucks at some bread. Oh, somewhere. I remember we spent that. Oh yeah, oh, oh yeah. And it was yeah. probably all on helping out battered uh, chickens and yeah. getting them new coops built. <laughs> It's fucking got me pinned down like this. This is my face. And he's like this. What the? No. Lips pucker, dude. Just coming in hot. And I was like, Salmon, 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 Salmon. Salmon! <laughs> you know? And like, and he goes, oh. <laughs> yeah, it's my fault because I'm fucking hot. I have hairy cucumber for you to eat. <laughs> what? Begin telling the story of Shred Butt. Okay, listen, so it went like this. I tell Mickey, I say, hey dude, I got an idea. Take me to the hardware store. That night before the contest, we go to the hardware store. Two rollers, a can of red paint. I'm, all, I'm already like cringing, crying, laughing. Mickey pulls up the fence, I slide under. I pull up for the Mickey, he can't get under the fence. So I get the roller and I, how do you do that? Make an S and an H. Yeah. That says shred and just crop. Dude, by the time I got to the two L's to cross the L's, I had my shirt was wet from laughter. On the other side, I was gonna make it say red balls, <laughs> which you never got to. The whole time there's vans, little van sprints, little size nines all over the ramp from the red paint. I go the next day, straight face, and Brian walks right up to me and he goes, how's it going? And he looks at my shoes. <laughs> I changed my shoes. I threw those fucking, in, oh, I threw the red shoes in the canal. <laughs> Word on the street is, is that you're sort of like Pete Ramondetta's life coach. Yeah, I might've given him a little too much life coaching yesterday. You know, I'll call him in the morning and be like, you're the fucking best, Pete. Start the day off like, bam. Just let's go to the nine stair, 10 stair rail. No, Pete, you wanna go to the 15 and 20. 20, 25, step it up. Did That's you, you Pete. And stop jumping on the bed. He watches TV and jumps on the bed all the time. Off the bed, Pete. He could be jumping on the bed watching this right now. I doubt it. But <laughs> Is Frank your new life coach? Maybe. Yeah, make Frank your life coach. He's worked wonders for fucking Peter Ramendetta. That's, that's what we heard. Give me a, like one good story of somebody fucking up. They would do the dumbest worst Stupid shit ever shit. and then yeah. run to get yeah. me, yeah. telling me the complete wrong story. I'd go over there, end up usually beating people up that didn't even probably deserve to get beat up. But one time I rushed over there and some super surfer flat knocked me out, busted my lip. <laughs> there was days I woke up and I was like, I should just go to Embarcadero every day. Dude, I remember I wore shorts there with fucking long johns underneath. And Mike Carroll goes, man, you vert skaters just love to wear shorts any opportunity. <laughs> I, was, I mean, my heart broke, dude. This is what they call a little handy. When you land a trick and you're by yourself, you clap, you get somebody to clap, you're like, <laughs> no one, no one wants to even walk down that hill. They, uh, John and I were drunk talking like, I bet you could be done, blah, blah, blah. And one morning he came to my house and they're like, wanna go skating? And they get in the van and there's like <laughs> hard hats and high vis gear. And I was like, we're not going to what I think we're going to right now. And they're like, the video's almost done. Do you want some? <laughs> I was like, oh no. It was real early in the morning and I wanted to get mil a milkshake at Wiz. <laughs> I had milkshakes on my mind. I said, if I pull this, I'm gonna get myself a banana milkshake. And I still haven't gotten one. But what? that look on your face is just, is seriously priceless. And you're just like. I live. Yeah. I'm alive. I mean, seriously, you're like, like I'm I, alive. I'm alive. That was like the whole business of that one. Just get, get out of this thing alive and we'll be good. Oh man. So here we go. There's a knock on the door. Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I knew, I knew Jim got, always has to do something. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. No smashing in the face. No, All right, no, so listen. None of that. 
You didn't know this was coming, right? No, but none of that. Wait, wait. I didn't know it was coming. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what this is? What? That's the new real ad. That's an ad? I hope something's misspelled, right? Is something Look misspelled? at your fucking name! <laughs> your name? No way. Herrero. Oh. <laughs> is that intentional? Yeah. That's so good. Thank you. <laughs> Fucking jersey. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a sec, man. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I got fucked on this deal. Yeah. Fuck you guys. Alrighty. Well, fucking hit the bricks, kid. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's nice. Go fuck yourself. See you next week for. <laughs>